Hey guys, Kid Gear here. Today I have a type of uh, app, kind of not review, but it's only in beta. It's called Digsby. Uh, it's more of a response to Duncan, uh, or Mobile Phone 2003. If you guys haven't heard of him, really check out his channel. He has awesome videos. Me and him have been talking a lot lately on his board. Well, not his board, but he's uh, active on this board here. And uh, I would recommend you join it, JCP, jcxp.net. Uh, it's really, really great. Uh, I've been talking to him a lot lately. He's a subscriber of mine, and I subscribe to his, of course. Um, well, anyways, he made a video uh, not too long ago. He uploaded a couple. Uh, just yesterday, he had a video on instant messenger plus social networking plus email equals Digsby. And uh, he asked uh, our opinions of what we thought about the app. So um, I'm going to give my opinion. And Digsby, guys, is really awesome. So... This is what it looks like with the skin I'm using right now, and basically, as he said in the video, it's social networking plus email plus I am. So here you have your two. I, your, I have my two I am clients. Uh, here's my new one. If you want to add me, I don't really get on, but I guess you can, you know, add me if you want. Uh, that's just a test account that I used to use. I'm just seeing if it would work. Um, so let's see here. Now I'm just gonna. What do you call that here? I'm gonna head over to my preferences and show you what you can uh, do here. So if you hit Add I Am Client, you can click MSN, AIM, Yahoo, Google Talk, ICQ, Jabber, or Facebook Chat. So it supports a pretty wide array of I Am clients. Go down to email and actually, uh, you can actually put all your emails in here. Not only can you put Gmail, Yahoo, Hotmail, and AOL or AIM, you can put Pop or IMAP so you can forward it from a site or whatever if you have it like with GoDaddy or something like that. Um, you can also add social networks. As of the beta, they only have three, but pretty good ones. Twitter, obviously. Facebook and MySpace, so you can do your little status updates, stuff like that. Uh, check your friends' requests, etc. It's a really, really great uh, application. Uh, not only does you can can you add all of these, but you can tell it where to show, and Duncan's go, don't, gone over that, so check out his video for a really detailed one. Uh, you can get changed skins. Mine's right now is using Darkness Red. So you can change the theme and the variants. You can label your buddy list conversations. You can order it, so it gives you way, way more uh, custom ability than it would in the you know MSN Messenger or Yahoo Messenger. Not only that, you can also check your um, email and do Twitter updates or tw tweets all from this one client. You can set your status. You can even set privacy stuff for your email addresses. Make widgets if you want to add a widget to your website or something like that. You can it'll give you the embed tag, and then you can just copy it. Um, so we can tell other people if you're on, you know, Digsby or whatever. And advanced. In advanced, you can disable sounds, stuff like that. You can even send notification sounds, set notification sounds. I set some for Twitter updates, stuff like that. I'm going to set a little bit more. So it's really, really customizable. Um, and I'm sure with, when the beta is done, um, you're going to, it's going to release a lot more, uh, f social networking clients stuff as, you know, Facebook stuff. Uh, pounds stuff like that, because we've been seeing a lot of integration with a uh, social networks lady. Whether it's lately, as uh, you know, we've seen a lot of Twitter uh, replicas stuff like that. We've seen Quippy. There's a uh, what is it? Plurk. There's a whole bunch of different ones nowadays. Uh, and as you see there, I just got a Twitter update. And if I click it, it'll actually take me to the page. So it can it'll open the page in your we uh, default web browser. You can check all your emails here within a w email preview. Just hover over it. I'll open it, and that's all spam from Yahoo. Uh, you can go over this, and as you see there, I'll just show right there. All in this great client. I'm gonna show you how it looks like when you connect. I'm gonna connect to my new account that I use for more for YouTube videos. Just gonna take this authenticating. You just enter your password, and as Duncan mentioned, you can actually just uh, set up and save your settings. And then let's say you download Digsby on another computer, you can just go ahead and log in right away. No need to set all these password journey settings, it'll be all set for you. So my buddies who are offline are in on offline or Vegas Underground. I haven't added that many people yet. But as you see there it's really, really great for an IM and you and you know, I'm just gonna show you what it looks like even though it's not on, I'm just gonna say send IM. And a thing that uh Duncan mes mentioned was that it supports call uh webcam and audio, which something that Pigeon and uh you know, Pigeon uh, lacks along with other there's some other uh, all-in-one apps uh, or IM clients that uh, lack the what do you call that the webcam feature or the audio feature now we're not sure yet if it's you have to have Digsby on Digsby or it can be Digsby to SM MSN Messenger I'm pretty sure though it should be Digsby to you know another client hopefully but so you see just for a beta it's really fully packed and it's really really customi customizable to your liking 
I give it a 9 out of 10. Uh, there is some, you know, things like that can update after the beta. It's just a little too simple, and, you know, I mean, it gets, uh, simple's great, but, you know, maybe you can add a little bit more functions, a little bit more, you know, uh, you know, features that they can integrate, and they can look at, you know, uh, twirl, and, you know, integrate some features from there. Uh, you know, just really look around and, you know, uh, give it a little bit more of a spice up to, you know, stuff like tweeting and sending updates. It's just a little bit too plain for me. I mean, simple's great, but, uh, that's just my opinion. Anyhow, uh, like I said, you can make the update show in your tray icon here, tray. The, all the icons can pop up here in the tray, you can show right here, or you can just have it show in both, it's up to you. So, it's really customizable, like I said. Uh, thanks, Duncan, for showing the great app. I give it, like I said, 9 out of 10. Anyhow, guys, uh, check it out, www.digsby.com, and don't forget to check out his uh, the forums there, jcxp.net, and, of course, Duncan's channel, Mobile Phone 2003. Anyhow, guys, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoyed it.